Eek Villain Returns has finally seen a drop in its box office collection. Mohit Suri's film starring John Abraham, Disha Patni, Arjun Kapoor and Tara Sitaria collected 23.54 crore rupees in its opening weekend. On day 11, August 1st, Eek Villain Returns collected in the range of 2 rupees and 75 paise to 2.85 crore. With this, the four-day total of the film stands in the vicinity of 26.50 crore rupees. The film has come down by nearly 55% on Monday as compared to the opening day. India Today.in gave Ake Villain returns 3 out of 5 stars. The film has a mega star cast and was expected to do decent business at the box office. However, the collections seem to be dipping even as fans continue giving positive reviews to the sequel of the 2014 film, Ake Villain. The original film starred Siddharth Malhotra, Shraddha Kapoor and Ritesh Deshmukh. Ek Villain Returns had a fair start and raked in 7.5 crore rupees on day 1. On day 3, the film's total collection amounted to 22.87 crore rupees. Ek Villain Returns made around 2 rupees and 75 paise to 2.85 crore on its fourth day, which is way below what it had to be. Hence, the total collection would now stand at approx 26.50 crore rupees reportedly. The first week of the film is heading towards 31 crore rupees and then, it will be a slow crawl to 40 crore rupees, trade reports suggest. Eek Villain Returns is the sequel to the 2014 hit film, Eek Villain, which starred Siddharth Malhotra, Shraddha Kapoor and Ritesh Deshmukh. While the first film of the franchise was about a conflict between a hero and a villain, Eek Villain Returns follows the story of two villains, with John Abraham and Arjun Kapoor essaying negative roles. Tara Sataria and Disha Patni play the female leads in the thriller. The film is hailmade by Mohit Suri. Eek Villain Returns marks John Abraham's first collaboration with the director. Meanwhile, Disha Patni played the lead role in Mohit's last directorial, Malang.